While the COVID-19 pandemic halted activity on campus, it certainly did not stop the university's light from shining bright throughout the Waco community and beyond. Right now as the university, I think really kind of leaning into our Christian mission to love our neighbors as ourselves. Jeremy Everett, the founder and executive director of the Baylor Collaborative on Hunger and Poverty, spoke with me about how his team created a curbside meal program once 200 Texas school districts announced they were going to close due to the virus. Our team uh, propped up a website um, and began to work with those school districts to be able to find out how they could serve meals to kids even when the kids were going to be out of school. Where kids essentially could just drive up um, to uh, a given, you know, like a school or a nonprofit organization or even a, like a church parking lot and pick up a meal and take it home. The team also is in partnership with the U.S. Department of Agriculture and has in works a program called Meals to You, where boxes of food will be shipped to kids who live in rural areas across the nation. We have this firm belief that that hunger and poverty are too big for any one organization or any one sector to address by themselves and that it takes a collaborative approach. So to be able to see kind of the, that theory come to life and yield millions, uh, millions of meals for kids around the country is uh, that's, that's pretty special. We either fall on our faith or we fall from our faith. And I've just seen so many people step into uh, and, and really depend upon our faith. Dr. Jeremy Vickers, the Associate Vice President of External Affairs at Baylor, tells me how their team stepped up during the pandemic. We want Baylor and Waco to be like brothers and sisters, uh, not separate but together. Uh, we have a vision that we want to paint the town green and gold. Will you talk about the initiative that your team took in response to COVID-19? So when the opportunity to move online, and by opportunity I mean crisis, we saw an opportunity to partner with Waco ISD to create uh, some inspiration and, uh, and help those students and their families just continue to be encouraged to read. Keep learning, keep reading. A campaign encouraging literacy during COVID-19. A series of videos are posted on the Solid Gold Neighbor Facebook page. Weekly posts feature Baylor and Waco community leaders reading their favorite children's book. And these are just two examples of organizations within Baylor University that have shifted their resources to serve in the fight against COVID-19. For Lariat TV News, reporting for Global News Relay, I'm Grace Smith.